Welcome back to Prime Time, y'all. And happy Easter. We don't made it to another Sunday. Got another story time for y'all today. I'm not gonna take up too much of y'all time. Because you know it's Easter. Y'all don't want y'all be eating y'all good food. Um playing games. Spending time with the fam. Hopefully y'all watch your prime time. Oh shit. Don't watch prime time with your family. <laughs> don't watch prime time with some videos y'all can watch, but most of them don't watch it with your family. Okay, so um before I get to this um the story time, I'm gonna need you to go ahead and hit that like, that subscribe button, and please, please, please don't forget to hit that notification bell so you don't miss when I upload. Now, um I wanna say how are we gonna start? This story time took place in was it August of last year? It was last year. I think it was August. No, bitch, it was September. September. So, as you see by the title, bitch, my license got suspended because, you know, I'm a speedster. And if you, in Illinois, if you um get, like, two tickets, they, like, suspend your shit or whatever. And then I had to, like, it's, hold on, we're going to get to that. They said, so, first ticket, and I'm getting... Then I got my last second ticket <laughs> that summer when I was heading to work. Because the bitch, I was speeding because I was late as fuck. I, you know, I had to dip. And this one cop pulled me over during the daytime. And I was probably like, bitch, why didn't you just do what you did in that one video? If y'all didn't go see that, I, when I hooked that with that one cop, go check that video out. That's a really good fucking video, bitch. Now, um... <laughs> So, this was during the daytime, and that cop was mean as fuck. Like, he, I could tell, like, he had the motherfucking cop mustache. He was mad as fuck. Like, I could tell, like, he was not gonna play no games with me. <laughs> he went ahead and got me my fucking ticket. Girl, I was fucking mad. Like, for real. I wasn't even going that fast. I was probably going, like, 15 over the limit. But, you know, he, whatever, gave me my ticket. And I want to say, y'all, after a month after that, here come August, because this happened in July when I got that second ticket. A month had passed, and... Uh, I get a letter in the mail talking about some, yeah, bitch, your license is suspended. <laughs> I was like, ooh. Okay. And? Yes, you do. But I'm going to suspend your driver's license indefinitely. You're going to suspend my license. My license been suspended here. You ain't doing nothing. <laughs> I ain't had a license 30 years. <laughs> what the hell you talking about? going to suspend my life. What that going to do? <laughs> I got keys. <laughs> Y'all, I didn't give a fuck. I was still driving. I didn't give a fuck. Because the bitch, like, I did not care. Like, it was, was what it was. So, here we are. September. You know, I just get off work. I drop my ex off at the house. And then I left back out. I left back out. I want to say, where was I going? I was probably going to the Sneaky Link house. But then I come back. And then home and then i see that my ex is gone so i'm like fuck it bitch i'm finna leave too i'm not finna be up in this boring ass house like by my motherfucking self so you know i grabbed my laptop because i was finna go edit uh at the time was my good good friend um michael bitch i can't even call him my friend because we was sleeping together me and him don't talk no more but that's a long story mike i'm gonna talk about that in the life update that i'm finna draw so me, I grab my laptop, I'm handing over to him. You know, I'm not speeding, you know, I'm driving regular. And then all of a sudden, I see a cop in the corner, and then he, like, he pulls in, like, he was already turning, so it was like he was coming for me already. So as soon as I pass him, he comes behind me. I'm like, oh, whatever, whatever. So I get ready to make my other turn. But before I make my other turn, I see him in the, um, in the rearview mirror like this. Because you know how the, the, the officers got the little keyboard and the little screen in the little car? So I'm like, why the fuck is he doing that? Like, what is he doing? I'm like, what is the purpose? So I'm like, let me go ahead and make my little turn. So as I'm making my turn, that's when he cut his motherfucking lights on. I'm like, I was the speed so why is he pulling me over? <sighs> I'm like, fuck it. I pull over. You know, I'm putting my motherfucking chopstick on. So I'm like, bitch. I do not need another ticket, but what's he calling me over for? Like, is this this one cop that I uh, curbed? Because that one cop, he still be trying to text me to this day. 
I stay be curving now. So I'm thinking it's him. I'm like, oh, bitch, let me get ready, cause child. So he goes ahead, pulls me over, mind you. I was a good looking cop, so I was like, I was getting ready. So he comes up to my window. He was like, license of registration. I'm like, you know, I hand it to him. He goes back to the car. Wait, before you go back to the car, I think I said something. What did I say? I forgot exactly what I said, but oh, I told him um my insurance is on my phone. So while he was waiting on me to do that, you know, I ain't gonna lie, I was flirting. And he was low-key flirting back, which was crazy. I'm like, oh bitch, we finna we finna get this popping. Mind you, fine officer. Next, you know, here comes another officer pulls up right behind him as I'm showing him my insurance. That's when I was like, oh, bitch, he finna have to fuck around and give me this ticket now because, bitch, I can't, I can't flirt with two officers at the same time. I'm like, fuck. So, uh, um, he takes that, go back to the thing. He talking to the old buddy, the officer in the back, and I'm like, shit, like, they talking for a long ass time. They looking back at me and stuff. While I'm in the car. I'm listening to some, to some Beyonce. Just like, damn. I'm gonna get a ticket. Mind you, y'all, my license is suspended. So I'm like, oh my God. <laughs> this is looking great. I should probably just tell him. They probably looking at it. I'm like, but it just suspended. So, like a month ago. So, they probably not even gonna see it. He come back to the car. You know, he look at me. He look inside my car and stuff like that. He was like, can you step out of the vehicle for me, please? I'm like, uh oh. He nasty, okay. I'm gonna get out. I'm like, he wanna do it with his buddy over here? I'm like, okay. So I get out the car, you know. I shut the door. We well, he walks me to the back of my car, and that's when he was like, some okay, I'm gonna need you to put your hands behind your back. And I was like, <laughs> What? What you mean? I'm like, okay, so as I'm putting my hands behind my back, that's when he was like, well, he was, you know, he went to his whole little spiel, like, you're under arrest because you're driving on suspended license. I was like, oh, I'm like, this bitch is arresting me. Oh, my God. <laughs> Mind you, as I'm getting arrested, here comes this black lady in her car. Like, she sees that I'm getting arrested. She pulls over. She pulls out her camera. Love her. Whoever you are, girl. I love you down because, like, these cops do be out here shady and they could have, like, beat my ass or whatever the fuck, whatever. Did something, but she was like, she pulled out her phone. She not playing. She like, uh, treat them right. <laughs> oh, love black women. So, as I'm getting arrested, I'm just like, it's like, I'm in shock. I didn't even say nothing. Usually, I always got some shit to say. But at this point, I'm just in shock, like, what the fuck? So, he walks me to a police car. Mind you, these cuffs are tight as fuck. I mean, I ain't never been handcuffed before, like, outside of, like, sex, but, like, it's, that's, it never, like, felt like this. I'm like, God damn, like, this shit tight. He puts me in the back of the motherfucking cop. He had, like, it wasn't, like, a cop car, but it was, like, a cop truck. And I'm like, damn, like, it, the seats was hard as fuck. Like, it was, like, plastic. I'm like, not even plastic, like, what the fuck they call that material? It was probably, like, hard plastic. It was hard, bitch. I'm in the back of the cop car, like, that's when I all him. I'm like, these cuffs are too tight. And he was like, well, I got them loosened when we at the station. Y'all. As soon as he said that, bitch, I started crying. <laughs> I started crying because I was like, bitch, he finna take me to jail. Like, what the fuck? That's when they all hit me at one time. I'm like, this is over, bitch. I'm like, I just, mind you, I had just got a new job. I'm like, oh my God, like, I'm about to lose my job. Now I'm finna lose my car. They talking about they got to repo my shit. <laughs> I'm gonna lose my car, all of that. I was just so fucking pressed. I'm in the back of the car. Nah, I was crying quietly. I wasn't like bawling or nothing, but I'm just in the back of the car. Like, <laughs> <laughs> And this man was like, some, are you okay? Y'all, I looked that up at him like, are you fucking for real? I'm in the back of a fucking cop car, arrested, crying. I'm like, 
no, I'm not okay. And you didn't want to, like, unloosen my cuffs. So, y'all, we drive for about 10 minutes to the police station. I cried for that whole 10 minutes. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. Like, I'm usually strong and shit with my emotions. But that time, bitch, I just broke down. <laughs> I broke down. I was sad as fuck. We get there. We get up in there. He, like, unlooses my cuffs to where it's, like, he takes it off on one hand. And then he, like, cuffs me to, like, the fucking bench. So I'm just cuffed to this bench. Mind you, I'm just, like, I'm trying to see if I can break out this bitch. Because, you know, I got a little skinny-ass wrist. So I'm, like, I'm over here trying to, like, get the fuck out of here. Even though, like, even if I did get out, like, what the fuck was I finna do, right? Like, <laughs> whatever. But as soon as I can feel that I'm, like, I'm stuck, I can't get free. Like, I don't know, claustrophobia came on me. I'm just, like, <gasps> I'm, like, oh, my God, I can't. I fucking I felt like an animal, y'all. Like, even though he was a tree, like he was a real nice officer. I just y'all, when you get arrested for your first time, it's like, what the fuck? I was just so blue. Like, I didn't know what to think. Like, I'm like, damn, can they can I make a phone call or some? So I call I think the first person I called was my mama. I called my mom. No. I don't think I called my mama first. I think I called Michael because that was the person's house I was heading over to. And he was like, oh, shit. Um, I'm going to come get you. Blah, blah, blah. Don't got to worry. He was like, when are you going to be? Oh, wait, y'all. I'm skipping the whole part. I'm skipping the whole part. I'm skipping, skip, skip, skip. skip. Sorry. <laughs> so as he finally uncussed me, has me some water. You know, I'm drinking. Cause they all come me talking about something. Yeah, he don't look like he finna be a threat. <laughs> bitch. <laughs> a threat? You don't think I'll be a threat? Bitch, I'll beat y'all ass. And I'm lying. They was gonna be my ass. They was some, oh, they was bound. They must be bound, child. I was gonna, they was gonna be my ass if I tried to run or something. I was getting shot. <laughs> I was getting tased, something. So they all come me. I'm just sitting on a bench. Tear dial. I was fucked up. And then he was like, okay. So he grabs my hand because, you know, walks me over to the thing and, you know, starts fingerprinting me. I'm like, wow. Bitch, I really feel like a criminal. He just fingerprinted my shit. I'm like, oh, my God. He Like, he did not miss a finger. Like, he's got all 10 of my shits. Like, he was not playing with me. I'm like, damn, that's it. Ain't no more stealing. <laughs> that's it for me. Oh, they gonna catch these hands. So I'm like, okay. I start crying again because I'm like, I really feel like a criminal. Like, I feel like, damn, like, this is what, what, like, what's going on? So, then that's when I started getting my mud shot, bitch. Usually, I was like, <laughs> I started crying again. He was like, I'm going to need you to pull yourself together so you can take the mud shot. I was like, <laughs> I'm like, okay, okay. <laughs> he took the first photo. I start crying again. He's like, okay, I'm gonna need you to turn to side. I'm like, okay. He took another photo. <laughs> okay, turn around. I'm like, okay. <laughs> Y'all, I just could not get it together for my mud shot. If y'all probably look at my mugshot online, if it's on there, I don't know. I probably look. I would look a hot mess. I was crying so fucking hard. I was crying so fucking hard. It's so bad. I just felt horrible. So, oh, this story's time all over the place. I'm so sorry, y'all. I'm tired, as y'all can see. I'm ready for my bed. It's calling. So, that's when I finally got done with the mugshot. He was like, Okay, you know, he had me some water, some tissue. I'm like, shit, you should have gave me this before, bitch, fuck. I'm like, okay, you can break your phone call because we're not arresting you, you know, you just can't be driving. I'm like, oh, okay, bad. He's like, so what, what is your plans for this weekend? As I get my phone ready. Y'all, when I tell y'all, I looked at this man. I'm like, what plans? You done took my car. 
He like, oh, you know, you're right, my bad. Like, this man was trying to make conversation with me so bad. I think he was, because he was trying to flirt and shit and stuff. And I'm like, I don't even want to flirt with you no more. Like, you know, pulling me over, arresting me, took my car. My shit is in repo now. Like, I don't even, you know, he was fine. It's just like, I was just so turned off because, like, bitch, I'm in jail. Not for real, for real, but I'm here. Like, fuck, I'm in a police station. I didn't even want to be bothered at that point. So, that's when I made my phone call. I'm like, Michael, a bitch just got arrested. I'm going to need you to come get me, blah, blah, blah. And, yeah. He's like, okay, I'm going to be on my way. I'm going to be there in 10 minutes. After I tell him the whole address in it, I'm like, cool. So, as I'm waiting for him to get there, I don't want to say I call my mom. I think I call my mom when I finally made it to his house. The whole time I'm in the car with Michael, when he finally do get me, um, Michael asked me questions and shit, like, damn, we go fix this, I'm, like, I know he was trying to cheer me up and shit and make me feel better, but y'all, the more he talked, I just got more pissed off, I'm like, look, I don't even want to talk about this shit, like, just drive, like, I don't, drive, Michael, fuck, okay, we make it to his house, I wasn't even in the mood for sex, y'all, and that's what I was really over there for. I was even moved. Even though, because I went to my other Sneaky Link house earlier, but like, y'all, like, my libido is like, we ain't gonna talk about it. So, um, <laughs> so, um, I finally called my mom, told her what happened. She like, oh my God, where are you? I'm gonna come pick you up right now. She comes pick me up, I wanna say 20 minutes later, um, Michael talking about something. You want to hit the bong and shit? <sighs> Fucking stoners, bitch. Ugh, can't stand them. They think you could just fix everything by smoking. <laughs> Which I, I probably did need some, but I'm like, I'm, I'm not a smoker, so I'm like, fuck it. No, I don't want no. Mm -mm. She picks me up, blah, blah, blah. Takes me back to my ex's house, because that's where I lived at at the time, to um, pack my stuff. But not all of it. It's like, pack some stuff so I could, like, be with her for a while while since I don't got my car. So I packed some bags and my when I get there, my ex is there. Bitch, I didn't tell him shit. I was just so mad at her. He just see that I'm packing shit. He like, oh my God, you leave? I'm like, no, I, I pretty much told him that I lost my car or whatever the weather. I didn't say shit beyond that. Packed up a black bag, all my point shit, drawers, toupees, yogurt, one bag, phone charger, just all my basic shit. And y'all, I dipped. And I stayed with my mamas. Now, I think that's all I'm going to say for this story time. Like, if y'all really want to know the rest of the tea after this story time, y'all going to have to go all the way back to my first video. Nope, not my first video. About how my ex tried to kill me. Y'all going to have to go watch that. Because that's pretty much like part two to all of this. <sighs> I'm so sorry, y'all, if this story was all over the place. I'm hungry and I'm tired. <laughs> but yeah, y'all. Thank you so much for like. Don't forget. And again, bitch. Don't forget to hit that motherfucking like button. Subscribe button. <laughs> subscribe. Subscribe button and notification bell. And happy Easter. And I'm going to catch y'all next time on another prime time.